What what missions we got? Ooh, I'm Belge here. Deadman's port. Oh, we got all the options. Zeal. Heavy Crucio siege tank. Artifact on some dead world called Zeal. Apparently oh, the dig. One of my favorites. My people established a new colony Safe on Haven. Haven Viking. It was going Wait, it's well, just Viking. The it's like dark. the Viking. Well, the Viking They're with enough upgrades. We still need to access the adjutant we retrieved from Tarsalus. Oh, no. Our old mercenary the associate, mine. Colonel Orlin, is an expert in Confederate code decryption. If our intel's right, he should still be based at the Merc Haven at Dead Man's Port. There's a rare gas on Belshir, the Protoss skull, the breath of creation. They think it'd be a gift from As a matter gods. of principle, I don't even want to do it. I, can you, can you get by without... I, I'm pretty sure you have to do that one because that's how you unlock the adjutant. Of course those Protoss will kill us if they catch us on their holy The Widowmine replaces the Vulture oh, because it's just a better version of Spider-Mines. This one is the Super Goliath. Which could be very helpful. Wait, no, no, no. Can I get anti-air? If I do the Viking mission, going into Belshir makes everything a lot easier. Ah, he is the man. We make a good team, me and you. Why are you here, Tosh? What do you mean, team? I, you, all he did you was say, hey, go me. solve my problems yeah. for me. I got another job for us on a world called Belshia. Interested? Maybe. But what's in it for me? Piracy ain't exactly my chosen path. Everyone knows Jim Rayner wants to put the hurt on Mengsk. I can help you with that. I can help you big time. I'll think about it. For the time being, welcome aboard the Hyperion. We'll talk later. Good. Meanwhile, you can just stand around and look at all our secret plans if you'd like. No problem. Just out of curiosity, I did some tests on the mineral. Yeah, the, the ghosts are weird. They're crazy, crazy ghosts. Crazy, crazy ghost people. We need some of that Protoss tech so I can get the armor upgrades as well. We need to. All right, we're narrowing it down to a Protoss mission. Which is all of them at this stage. <sighs> Siege tanks would make this mission a lot easier as well. What do we got? We got the Reaper. Plus one range, plus three. Like, this makes the Reapers replace... Well, the Legionnaires are still good as well. Vehicles, diamondbacks. Honestly, those grenades are ridiculous. I don't... The G4 clusterfuck. Oh my, so how much is it gonna... 135k for the full set? Fire bats. The Firebat suit contains a volatile mix of gases that seep into the operator compartment. This may explain why Firebat personnel are almost universally re-socialized criminals or psychotic pyromaniacs. Perdition flamethrowers spew combustoplasma at enemy targets. The plasma easily seeps into gaps in Zerg carapaces. Smaller Zerg creatures are literally cooked alive inside their own skins. Fire washes the skin off the bone. And the sin of the soul. It cleans away the dirt. And my mama didn't raise herself no dirty boy. Franco Tilden, widely credited as the first fighting fire bat in reformed mass murder. I don't want little ones. Viking. This mission, do I need Vikings for the dig? 
I don't think so. I think we get enough siege tanks. That'll solve most of your problems, right? Like... What do you get from Haven? Oh, it's a question mark because of uh, reasons. Big question mark on that one. All right. I'm a, you know what? Pre Reaper ups. I mean, there's no going back after this. Hopefully I get enough credits to afford everything else. I'm ugh, the Reaper upgrades are insane. Like that is it's so good. And yeah. Let's see, what about the lab? Yeah, what do we need? Honestly, Hercules or Predator, I'm probably gonna go Hercules so I can do dramatic doom drops to try to desperately win the mission when everything else fails. Oh my god. Reaper upgrades still require tech labs. You don't have to get any of the upgrades in the game. Like, mid-game. At least so far, that I've noticed. Like, they're all from the armory built in. Or from research mid-mission. All right. Protect the colony. We're almost to Haven, but there's still been no contact from... Sir. There's a Protoss fleet holding in orbit. They're disrupting all communications to the surface. And it looks like they're powering up their main weapons. Jim, you have to stop this. Matt, open a channel to the Protoss. Let's see how diplomatic they're feeling. Intaro Tassadar, James Raynor. I am Executor My Salinas. friends call me Jimmy, Your so James will be fine. To Iyer are known to us. Intaro Tassadar, Salendis. Listen, with all due respect, your fleet needs to pull back. The people on Haven are no threat to you. Our observers detected Zerg hive spores infesting the colonists. They must be purified. If you wish to undertake this mission in our stead, we will permit it. Jim, some of my people are infested. But you can't let the Protoss just destroy them all. If you keep the Protoss at bay, I know I can find a cure for the infestation. The only cure for Zerg infestation is purification by fire. You know this to be true, James Raynor. I can cure them, Jim. Believe me. If you choose to resist us, we will meet in glorious combat. The choice is yours, James Raynor. We await your answer. Hmm. Well, I think it's time I can finally bring this one up. Uh, some of you may have seen this, but what would that look like? So this is a fan-made cinematic for StarCraft. Not quite Blizzard level, but for a single person. This person has also made a lot of really cool art for SC2. Let's see what would happen if the Protoss faced against the Terrans. If the government of Valerian May, we're just gonna Haven came under the protection. Oh wait, it is based around this mission. I I I know why it popped into my head, though it is a bit of a different timeline. Um. Uh. Anyway, so they're coming back to murder Haven again in the future, but now like. <laughs> So the Protoss, not right in the head, arguably never were, but, you know.
Wait, why can't you stun air units like that? That's a good point, Cinematic. You should be able to graviton stun, Phoenix is. Ah yes, real scale void ray. Good enough. They just jump. So this is from the timeline where we go with the doctor, by the way. That is fan-made, yes. Here's the link. Yeah, he's also made a lot of... Uh, so, also, very cool. I'm like, can I use some of your art in my thumbnails? He's like, yes! That would be, like, of course, I haven't done it much lately because he, he mostly likes Brood War, but. There you go. He's made a lot of. Uh, like. Very cool looking kind of. uh Pseudo realistic art for starcraft so make sure to check them out yeah anyways so uh there's your simulation of how that battle would go and based on that i will say uh doesn't seem good for the terrans i think the terrans lost in that is what happened um so yeah honestly very impressive Makes me want, I, every time you see stuff like that, you're like, where's my goddamn StarCraft movie? Or like a really campy TV show. Okay? Like. <laughs> I want Tom Hardy as Tychus. I don't even care. The accent doesn't need to be the same. I don't. <laughs> uh... I don't know who else I want for the other ones, but. The guy who plays the, the, what is it, Ermintrout in Breaking Bad, he can be. Or you know what, Brian Cranston. You know what, I'm just thinking of Breaking Bad actors. Mengsk. There you go, Brian Cranston is Mengsk. Is it Brian? Is his name Brian? I don't know. You know, you know who I'm saying. The, 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 the Breaking Bad dude. It is uh okay, so what was I saying? Um 
I guess he is kind of a villain in Breaking Bad too. And by kind of, I mean he is. Not really relevant. I'd, I've never really done this mission, I don't think. I kind of want to see what it's like, so... Wait, wait, wait. No, I haven't done this one. I need Protoss research. We're going with the canon version. I'm so sorry, Ariel. But the executor's right. Believe me, they wouldn't have come all the way here if their data wasn't conclusive. Mm. Call off your fleet, Solendus. This is a Terran thing. I'll handle it myself. This is a what? Terran. This isn't right. I thought you were a better man than this, Jim. Ariel. If there was a cure, you would have found it by now. The only thing we can do is put an end to this once and for all. I won't accept that. Every one of my people can be saved. I'm close to finding the cure. I know it. Honor to you, James Raynor. You were ever a true friend of the Protoss. Although this work is painful for you, many more lives will be saved by your actions this day. We've all laid it on the line for these folks more than once. But there's only one way we can help. So, yeah, it didn't work out. So the last, like, four missions we did of this end up coming to nothing. Cool, cool, cool. New subscriber detected. Hoonang Nang is chilling for eight Infestation months. Infestation source detected. Sir, that virophage structure is spreading the Zerg virus. Virophage? Oh, you got mail. Okay, if I hear Matt m explain basic objectives to Colonel... Well, this is embarrassing. <laughs> but again, we need your help to save the colony. One could argue that colonizing a planet in the Protoss space while potentially harboring Zerg spores would be a bad idea. And they would probably be right, but they would be far too smart to be a colonist anyways. Nevertheless... <laughs> You should know that the young government provides you with 10,000 additional credits for every save settlement. We're counting on you. I'm so sorry. You know what? These these emails are adding a lot to the realism, in my opinion. <laughs> All right. Captain Gavin Thorne. Marshal. Is he a captain or is he a marshal captain? Marshal colonial captain. Okay. Mr. Marshal colonial captain Gavin Thorne. Marshall isn't a rank, but Marshall with two L's. Wait, and, uh, you know, Captain Gavin Thorne is just his name. Okay. Have it, Haven Colonial Marshall is his rank. His parents named him Captain. All right, he had a lot to live up to. It was a weird choice that it's a weird choice Stay now. Sharp. I want anyone that leaves the ship wearing a suit. Thing I need is more people getting Doesn't invested. everybody wear a suit except when they want to say something brother. dramatic and then they take their My suit off, exposing staying. them to getting shot in the face? You, though, oh, wait, we got Super Vikings. Cool, cool, cool. Let's get I remember, even on Nightmare, I was able to do this mission Fine. with, like, Fine. mostly just... I like it. Vikings here, so... Let's see, what do we got? We have the torpedoes. Do they have the AoE version? That some of the fancy Vikings do? They don't have the damage point upgrade. So Vikings and multiplayer got buffed by the Terran conglomerate, for those who don't know. Their damage point is lower, which means that their attack goes off quicker and you can stutter step them more quickly. But these are Wings of Liberty Vikings, which are actually less micro both. Because the damage point is, like, twice as high. Still very micro -able, but it's throwing me off just a little bit. I wonder how much damage they have on the ground. I'm gonna land one. Inbound. Let's get into the fight. I love Vikings. 18 damage every one second. 
And we should hit the deck. Oh my god. Gonna wall off of planetary. Just need to wipe out the broods and then can land. Is that all the air? Oh, wait, those are the uh. Those are the multiplayer infested Terrans. But we can hold them. Jesus. They're kind of stuck. Can I target the little eggs? Oh my god, they have so much armor. I can't move! There. Oh my, just kill Elmo. The infested are heading to a settlement in the south. Been waiting on you. I'm on my way. Insufficient. I wonder if that was triggered by me uh, solving that or if it was just a timer. They're so good. It's a bit disgusting. Insufficient. So I just have to keep it from finishing, right? How long? How long until it gets infested? There's no timer. Those shields are so useful. Yeah, imagine having shields and being able to repair your units. Oh my god. Timer's the animation. Can I hit it from the high ground here? Because if so, we're good to go. I think so. Oh. Is it almost done? Save. What a save! What a save! says Dr. Hansen has locked herself in the lab. Hmm. Alone. I wonder what's she going on there. I'm worried about what she might do. She's been a bit unstable lately. Oh shit, the weapon... The ship and mech weapons are split. I know there's another, um... Wait, why? Oh, I need... I needed to actually clear this. I think. Oh, I should get a uh, sensor tower as well. For the attack speed. What the hell is this? Oh, wait, I'm not supposed... Why does it give me... Okay, you know what? It counted it. That's fine. What the fuck? Insufficient Vespian gas. Excuse me. Agreed. Ready to plunder. Sir, another settlement is being infested by the Which one? Over here. <laughs> Been waiting on you. Fight or flight? Yeah, right. Almost enough to one shot corruptors now. Transformation 
There we go. I can just fight with this much firepower on the ground. Unfortunately, my upgrade still max at plus one. But otherwise. Just get stepping. I'm not sure, like, Agreed. what it means by protect the settlements. But, like, in total. Yes, you could take one of us. Oh my god, the most damage my Vikings have taken so far is to the investors. Classic. I mean, to my own Viking. Ah! Damn, look at the range. You know what? Whatever. Out of energy now. They'll expect one of us in the wreckage, brother. Big job, huh? Made for battle. <laughs> Resubscription FCD confirmed. Ready. Automatically relay. No Thanks. Mm. Rogue Assassin 95 oh. is chilling for 34 like months. Alright. Are those infested Terrans timing out? I don't think so. Oh, that's a siege tank. Hold. Another settlement is coming under attack. Inbound. Hmm. All right. This air bl fly higher. Sorry, no can do, sir. You ready for war? Made for battle. SCV ready. Hmm. Certainly. I was rude. Inbound. Fighter. Let's press. You ready for war? Cost of doing business. Let's get in and fight. Mineral field depleted. No one can survive. God, so many investors. Take a seat. Micro. We're counting it. What? <laughs> oh yes, because what we what we needed was another Viking buff. You're really hurting. Let's get into the fight. With these Vikings. How fast? Whoop! For your push-ups. Missile range and and ground range. Oh my god. We were struggling, but now I guess we'll have a chance with these Vikings. I think we should just take out this nearby one. You ready for war? Ready to plunder. Made for battle. Let's... You gonna 
fight or flight? Yeah, right. Victory. Very well. I'm tempted to just fight it. Hit, sit down. Okay, how many Vikings do- that the, the problem is having to have enough space on the ground. Sir, the infested are closing in on a settlement to the north. Let's get into the fight. Transformation system You gonna give me order? Hmm. You ready? battle. Gonna need a repair. Wait, if I get healed by the medics, it doesn't cost money to repair, does it? The doctor is in. Obviously, it's not quite as fast, but... Where does it hurt? You ready for war? Very well. Fight or flight. I don't love how that went, but... Made for battle. Mineral field. How many infester? I don't see any there. Get into the fight. Inbound. Because it's so here. Put them down! But there's another one over there. They're outside the bases, it seems. Or you won't obviously see them. That ultra's too thick. They can't get through. Need help, sir? I still, this is something weird's going Fire on with that. You know what? Move the SCVs out of the way. I don't want to waste my minerals when I could just get healed by the max. Hey, I said move. Don't you need to kill all the bill? The thing is, they weren't taking damage. Maybe it's just because I didn't focus fire hard enough. Like, oh yeah. Wow, that's that requires a lot of DPS. Okay, you're right. Oh, oh my god, the broodlings. Sir, another settlement is being infested by the Zerg. Transformation system. Let's get into the fight. Broodlings are actually really scary. Victory. Transform you fight or flight. We're taking damage. I thought it was just like a weird bug, but no. I'm dumb. I love my growing the Vikings. Exhausted. Very satisfying. Transformation system. We've also got a couple of perma. Patches there, so not to worry too much. Additional supplies. Go ahead. Transformation system. They deal. All right. I'll survive, I guess. Just in case the Vikings were good enough already. You know what? That's gonna be a bad turn. Transformation systems. Failing.
That's very rude. Take a seat. Everyone. Oh my god, they're putting the Vikings back up. It's such a weird fight. Stuck in the planetary. The infested are heading to a settlement in the south. Need help, sir? Mm. You gotta go deal with it. I don't like. I have to have all the all of the, them saved for the max monies. Transformation systems primed. I like. What are the upgrades? Three three in the air. That's no match for this level of Viking firepower, though. How about on the ground? Also three three. Everything three three. No investor. What about just dropping and target firing the thing? Let's get into the fight. Fire point. Yeah, right. Save. I knew Raider like save us. Agree. Made for battle. Transformation systems prime. Okay, we got like a minute until they infest another one. If we don't get rid of it, it's just going to keep happening. Bongo! Let's at least get the hive. Standing by. Ultras. Doing real damage. Do I not have building armor? To just target it. I 
Ah, I was taking so much damage because... Hmm. Pretty rough. I've lost so many! The medics have no damage! They just won't die. I don't know. I don't love that. I don't love that at all. Hmm. I think you're at that mess. No, you lose so much if you do that, though. Literally, the Vikings can't fucking land. They, there's, they're too thick. Oh, wait. If only the viral page was a little bit taller. Okay. <laughs> then we could shoot it from the air. Oh my god, so the most of the damage was dealt by my, uh... by my own viking ruining it. I don't know if this was any better, to be honest. But if I take this base, I can rebuild pretty easily. Base is under attack. <laughs> the only issue was the ultras from before. Need help, sir? You ready for fighter? Made for battle. Say the word. Fight or flight. You ready for war? Transformation. Yo, where did my command center go? Inbound. Certainly. I've protected this. Is this a. Uh, I guess we're. You have to destroy the. Okay, we gotta go back a bit. There is no real timer on dealing with the northern base, as long as I just stay efficient. Like, we can get deal with the ultras. Agreed. Transformation system. What we need gotcha. is some better SimCity building armor. Some of this. I'm actually going to bring in Jimmy for the snipes. Because we do have the infinity patches as well. Yeah, there's the timer on the mission is that the waves get worse over time, but like. That settlement has been cleared of Zerg biosignatures. Well done, sir. Transformation systems prime. Is it critical? Just Please state the nature of your fight or flight. Yeah, right. Burn and kill it. You ready for it? Yeah. Right. Sir, another settlement is being infested by the Zerg. Mm -hmm. yeah, right. We gotta deal with that one. Back off, man. I'm a scientist. Uh, Transformation systems prime. And then I'll have some time to work on the uh, main one. Let's get into the fight. You gonna give me orders? What's the plan? Twenty-four Vikings. There's at least one infester. There are the ultras, but this time they're gonna have a much tougher. Yeah, infester. Lose one Viking, maybe two.
Much better. Certainly. That was too close. You ready Thanks. for war? Victory. Hmm. Neep. The doctor is in. Certainly. Transformation systems primed. Fighter flight. Yeah. Right. Need some triage? Just fast. Thanks. He's under attack. Ready to play. Let's get into the fight. Ready for battle. Inbound. Victory. Let's get up that fighter. Fighter flight. Yeah, right. You ready for war? Hmm. Let's get into the fight. No wait, don't send that. He's just throwing those out. Fight or flight. Made for battle. Dredge. You ready for war? Thanks. He's under attack. What's up? So can't hold him alone. Fight or flight. Yeah. You need some triage? Oh, he's going for the men. is coming under attack. All right. Fight or flight. Yeah, right. It'd be nice if I knew the actual timer. Transformation systems prime. Where does it hurt? Let's get up that Even if I have to come back. Whatever. Another investor. Agreed. Not enough energy. Inbound. The simulation success. Alright. Very well. That one's a bit dicey. So that annoying like checkpoint. That does look bad, doesn't it? We lost three Vikings. There's probably a random infester on the way out. Always a random infester. What? Why is there a circling on the radio chatter? When did they learn to use the radios? Let's see how bad it's. Okay, they didn't reinfest. There's one infester. But... So, Statman doesn't actually heal the air stuff. So. Low and steady. Okay, I'm work. Yeah, it doesn't give you too much. I'm working. I don't even have the upgrades. Like, you need to have the firepower to actually deal with this. All 
right. This sector is clear. Nice work. Boys. Down to three. Where does it hurt? Go hide in the corner for a while. All right, where's the inevitable investor? Oh, no investor. You can kind of see by how done the hatch is. Alright. We'll have these guys just sit back here as a staging area where hopefully the Zerg. <laughs> Don't worry, they can slap down a turret or something. If they need to. Oh, come back inside. Where are you going? Let's get into the fight. Made for battle. Alright, now we go for the real bases. Mm. It's gonna be a pain, but hopefully not deadly. Sir. Another settlement is being infested okay. by Zerg. No one lives forever. Ready to plunder. Agreed. Victory. Our SCVs are under attack. Yes, indeed. Inbound. Is under attack. We gotta stop going back for repairs, I guess. Um. Excuse me. Time to deal with more. All right. Agreed. Fight or fight. Yeah, right. You know what? I think we just gotta do this and then. Ah, my own Viking! That's what I was trying, like. My own Viking is just ruining me. <sighs> so... Yeah, I could take the base to the north. I thought there were no infestors, which was dumb, because there's always infestors, but... Well, you know what? What if we land everyone right off the bat? You just can't do that much damage, right? So that way, infestors of the ground don't hurt as bad. And then we uh, lift off and get knurled. Beautiful, maybe. Oh, yeah, at least it was a ground one. Okay, so. Nope. Or we just go to the northern base, use it to build up a ground army, and just roll through. How about that? While continuing to put out fires at the Vikings. No one Is it critical? Fucking hell. Unacceptable levels. Ready to blunder. Need help, sir? Certainly. I'm lifting my main, because of course. Go ahead. 
I probably... Yeah, we still have the long distance patches here. Yeah, yeah. Let's get into the fight. Back off. What's going on? Big job, huh? Big grin. I'm just rampage. The infested are heading to a settlement in the south. Of course they are. You ready for war? Oh, there's an infester here. I can only land half my butt. You know, what? maybe my my fighter group should be smaller. So that way I can actually land them. Real concerns. What's going on? Big huh? Transformation systems prime. Yeah, the plus three on the <laughs> I mean, the Vikings do good damage, but they're super squishy. Slow and steady. That was too close. Thanks. Got back on the rang. Need help, sir? No one. Just fast. Back off. Let's get into the fight. You want a piece of me, boy? I'm not even sure. Wait, okay, so. No, it just calls down. So I get four Marines for the price of three. That's the benefit. <laughs> That's all I get from that. Standing back off, man. I'm a scientist. What's up? Sell me. Made for battle. The Reaper has arrived. Huh? Yep. And the Reaper. Go ahead. What's the big job? Upgrade complete. <laughs> Sir, another settlement is being infested by the Zerg. The Grim Reaper has arrived. Ah. <sighs> You know, if I could just keep doing this, maybe I will eventually find a cure. <laughs> Complete. Go ahead. Transformation. Oh yeah, I gotta fight on the ground. That's a brute lord up there. You want a piece of me, boy? I just like using the units. Like I, I'm intentionally doing this playthrough, and that's why I picked the Mobius mod because, like, even though it's difficult, it's still fun. Like I probably could have pushed to end it with the most ideal units, like 20 minutes ago. But we ain't laddering right now. With the Vikings over the top and then fire bat, uh, Made for What's medic up? on the ground. Transformation systems primed. I think we're in uh, pretty pretty good shape. Talk to me. We're gonna do one more and then well we're gonna start with the ground army pushing. These are the juggernaut fire. They have 185. They have 235 HP. Four armor, immune to banelings, um, and 
uh, four range as well as a huge radius, so. Those things have half the effective HP of an Ultralisk. Wait, do Ultras have 400 or 500? Another settlement is coming under attack. Oh, there's not a single Ultra over here. When I needed it most. Inbound. Break it down. You can count them. Bad news. Let's get into the fight. One infester. Okay. Information systems primed. Bold. This better be good. The second is successful. No one lives forever. Take it down. This better be sell me. What's the plan? Raiders roll. Transformation systems primed. Okay, fight or flight. Ready for war? We all begin to want you. Very well. Transformation systems primed. That's the negatory. Blocked. Simulation successful. Victory. All right. Very well. What's the plan? Unacceptable landing zone. Go ahead. Oh my god. That flight path. Should just build the sensor towers up here. They give attack range, and also they're my scans right now, so. Attack speed, not attack range. Maybe range, but at least speed. What's the plan? Sounds like made for battle. And they're gonna go off and fest some more stuffs. Hey! What happens if you infest an infester? Sir, another settlement is being infested by the Zerg. Go, go, go! Game paused.
first nothing. So you can neural parasite a neural parasiting infester. The neural parasiting infester can cast the spells. New subscriber detected. Which are of that DJC underscore plays is chilling for one month. Oh, that's the wrong one. Then it still casts for the other side, despite the neural parasiting infester being on the. It made things more complicated. Um... When infested Terrans were involved. Game resumed. Fight or flight. Yeah, right. <laughs> Mineral field depleted. No, if I didn't have those shields, that would have been very upsetting. Banelings hurt a lot. I lost several units there. You know, it, it's, I'm struggling to get the fire bats out in front. I have it all done. I'm gonna get this siege tank. I'm gonna move on with my life. Oh my god! So what is the attack speed? Oh, the increased range and fire rate. Oh. So it is plus one range and about 10% attack speed. So it's both. Good to know. What's up? Thanks. Sounds like a plan. Transformation systems provide. Get ready for war. We did so, it. It's done. I'm not detecting any more Zerg, but we have a problem in the lab. And all like less than an hour. Uh, easy peasy. Also, that is in StarCraft time, but still. <laughs> hmm, a problem in the lab, you say? I wonder. What could be the problem?
Ariel. You in here? Matt, seal all access points. Good thing we kept that helmet open. Jimmy doesn't know how to read, which is why he didn't expect this. Will you enjoy it? Will you enjoy killing me? Like you killed my children? You're infested. You're dead already. Yeah, Jimmy would never go out of his way to save someone from being infested. Do it. Finish it. Ah, load the plot device bullet. Much more dramatic one. Good thing, good thing Jimmy kept his helmet open so he could get it exposed to the Zerg spores. best and only source for news, this is Donnie Vermillion for UNN. Refugees continue to flood Dominion space. They can't seem to find a safe planet anywhere, and they're showing up on our doorsteps. Donnie, Emperor Mengsk today announced that he's ordered the fleet to turn away refugee ships that enter core world systems, which raises the question, will Dominion ships really fire on unarmed civilian vessels? General Warfield had this to say. All our efforts at this time are focused on halting the Zerg advance on the core world. In other words, the general dodged the question. If Dominion forces fire on unarmed civilians... Now, Kate, we can't second-guess our boys in the field, can we? You heard it here first. For UNN, I'm Donny Vermillion. Oh, Mengsk is finding that running an empire ain't all it's cracked up to be. But when it came to making love, I learned my ABCs... <laughs> I heard about what went down in the lab. Pity that. But don't let yourself get distracted from what Always has to important be done. to hear what Tosh has to Take say. my advice. Keep it simple. No attachments. No strings. Just you. Against the universe. Sometimes I feel like anything I start caring about just gets destroyed. Not your fault. Did you ever stop and think what had happened if all those refugees from Agria had gone to the core world? Pastor's just here. That Hansen was a honey trap <laughs> right from the start. No, and that's the end of the conversation. That's it. That's the whole thing. You came to the right place. I'm pretty sure you get, yeah, three fighters. You know, if I get the other upgrade thing, I could get it for the uh, fire bats. And medics. And reapers. And how much is, like, 22.5% HP anyway, compared to keeping the medics and marauders, which are also there? You know what? I've come around, okay? We're getting the, like, 
The bio units are just way too good. New subscriber detected. Alfonso underscore Dufok is chilling no for 35 That doesn't mean months. no mech, but the mech's gonna be like siege tanks and widow mines, both of which should not be taking many hits anyways. Ah, oh, widow mines. Mm-hmm. Stepman, congratulations! Need more samples. You've been promoted to back to only scientist. Congratulations! All right, artifact. Oh, oh, don't worry. I know what you're gonna say. I haven't been running diagnostics on them or anything. Just spit it out, son. So holding these things. Yeah. Okay. All right. Seems safe. Oh wait, Swan has a conversation. Do you think we could have saved more of those colonists? Honest? No. And you got your head up your ass if you think any different. There had to be a better answer, though. Maybe if we caught it earlier. Look, if the Protoss, with all their tech, psionics, and big freaking alien brains couldn't do anything for them, there ain't Eight. nothing we could have done. <sighs> Sometimes life's just rough that way. But Swan... You, you can repair their detected. units, and they can't. Five I wouldn't say. Five minute is chilling for fifty-eight months. Viking pilots are a rare breed. Few pilots can master both forms of the vehicle. A Viking pilot is a cherry until he's been inside one during a transformation. The twisting metal can kill less agile men. The elite few who make it through training are so deadly that their names are well known by both allies and enemies across the sector. Viking servos are interchangeable. SCVs can scavenge a Viking's arm to repair the more important leg assembly. How fun!